Yo guys, welcome back to a brand new video, me really here, and today the video has come, the video you have all been waiting for, it's how to make an awesome cursor that looks something like this, okay? So basically this cursor right here, uh, I made it myself, and it's not that hard as you might think, like, all you do is just, wait a minute, why, why, why is there so many people in here, come on! Get on my video, bro. I'm trying to make a video. Anyways, I was trying to say that I'm gonna teach you how I make my cursors. So right now, I only use this one since I have the legendary dragon. But yeah, I'm gonna teach you how to make a new one, how I make mine, and uh, how you can make your own one. Okay, so for this uh, tutorial, all you need is a photo editing software you need internet because you need to watch this video and you also need a website and you also need some common knowledge in how to enable a cursor you know what let's just make a diamond lock because why not okay so what I like to do I just click like this and then click on information because now you get the uh, large picture of the diamond lock uh, when you need to take a picture okay uh, to make this look very clean, you have to press the button on your keyboard where it says PRTSCN. It means print screen, okay? It will take a picture of your screen. Anyways, what I tried to say to you is you have to click here, either on the drop or on the information. Um, then you press print screen. You click uh, Windows key plus D. Then on the small bar down here, you press this icon, and without touching anything, with, don't touch anything now. All you do is press print screen on your keyboard. When you've done that, you should have a picture uh, on your clipboard. So all you need to do now is go to your uh, picture editing software. I use GIMP. Okay, so I am in GIMP at the moment. So all you gotta do now is... Uh, press hold in control and then press V and look at that and don't care about the second monitor uh, it's just because I have two monitors so yeah it should be something like this for you you should only get this picture and that's what you want to get okay if it didn't work just start from the beginning and uh, do it all over again now with your editing software just crop out and grab your um, picture I'm gonna just use this tool to remove everything that's outside and here I have a perfect image of a diamond lock now for cursors you want to make a picture that's 80 times 80 don't ask me why it's just how it is uh, 80 times 80 and then you have to crop it in so it's perfectly in there there we go it's almost perfect and it's good enough so all you gotta do now is export the image into a PNG file and uh, it's different how you do it from every single editing software, but just make it a PNG file. Now you should have a PNG file with your diamond lock right there. All you gotta do now is go to this website right here, cursor.cc, okay, cursor.cc. Uh, just search that on your search bar or, or in Google and you will find it straight away. And now you have to click on this right here, import image, and now uh, sorry because this is in Norwegian this right here. It says select file. Okay. Um, I Will censor this because it can show the directory of my files uh, but yeah You just click here select your image. I selected dl.png click upload and There we go. You have your picture here, and it's set to go. It's perfect and um what you can do in here, you can do a lot, basically, you can like, uh, draw in here, you can actually make cursors uh, by just drawing in here, but if you want a Grotopia image, you just gotta import the image. Now, you see this right here, it says hotspot where the mouse clicks. Select that somewhere yeah, where you wanna click, so this marker right here, it's where you're clicking, okay? So you just press where you want to press um, You can press on add shadow just to add some shadow 
Um, not sure if that was good. But anyways, who cares? Uh, you just do whatever you want to your cursor. Uh, you can draw on it. You can just edit everything you want to do. And when you're done, when you're happy about it, you just click download cursor. You download the cursor down here. You select where you want to save it. Now you have a cursor file on your desktop, just like this one. Okay, with this file, you can just uh, follow my steps to select the cursor. Okay, so what you gotta do now is go to the search bar, type control panel, and then find mouse. Okay, find mouse when you click on that, this window should pop up, and you should click on the second one it says cursors and then you click here um, I selected the cursor uh, you just click here find the cursor and now click use and there we go guys you have a diamond lock cursor you can make whatever cursor you want to uh, this was a little bit too big so you might have to make the image for example 40 times 40 um, but every wor everything works fine depending on how big you want a cursor you just have to try and play around with it and you can basically make anything okay any item in a game yeah thank you so much for watching the video i hope this helped out a lot and i hope you will make a lot of cool cursors send me a picture on discord when you made the, a cursor or share with anyone in instagram or whatever so yeah good night see you tomorrow guys